So if you want to have a seizure, you choose this one. If you want to set the mood with your lady, you choose this one. If perhaps you're a fan of Katy Perry and you like her song Firework, you can play this one. Shoots up, explodes down. Shoots up, explodes down. Well, ho, 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 YouTube. Welcome back to Gadget Jeff TV. And today we're going to be reviewing Tree Hue, the smart Christmas tree lights that you control with your phone. It's coming up next. Gadget Jeff. Beep -beep. Well, hello everyone. Thanks again for tuning back in if you're a subscriber or if you're new to my channel, thanks for stopping by where I review cool toys and gadgets. To all my fellow subscribers, um, I appreciate you staying with me. I know it's been about six months since my last upload and I keep making empty promises that I'm going to make new videos and then I don't. But I am trying and today I'm here with a new video. Now first off, I had to darken my room to showcase these new lights and uh, the audio with my mouth isn't really syncing 100% because I have a cheap webcam. So apologies in advance. Now we've all seen Christmas lights of every different color imaginable on Christmas trees. Those have been out for quite some time, but these new lights you control with your phone. These lights are Wi-Fi enabled, have over 16 million colors, 150 animations and effects. Now once you have the app downloaded, you can either choose from solid colors, color gradients, or animations. And I'm gonna quickly go through some of these. I can't go through all of them, otherwise it'd be a 15, 20 minute video. And I like to think I'm that entertaining, but I wanna make it short and sweet. So on the solid color tab, you have this little slider bar with all the colors. You can just drag it, whoop, whoop. Come on, you little bastard, there we go. And it turns the color, whoop, let's get it out of the way. Turns the color to the next one. We got green, or no, yellow. Forgive me, this is kind of a shitty review so far, but it's gonna get better, I promise. Here we go. Red, pink, light blue, dark blue. Teal, really light blue? Light green, mellow yellow. Canary yellow, orange, blood orange, light pink and of course white so next up our color gradients i'm going to save animations at the very end because those are the coolest and i want you to watch this video all the way through uh because it's worth it so for color gradients there's about 50 different ones you can just scroll through you can't really see the color so well on my webcam but there's a little preview of what each effect is going to do so all you have to do is select which one you want and then press this little button in the corner to send it and it sends it to the tree. Isn't that fantastic? Gradient example one, gradient example two. I also wanted to remove my webcam, kind of show you behind the scenes here. Uh, there's a total of 98 LEDs and my tree isn't large enough to fit all of them. So some are on the floor there. Uh, so this isn't giving you a full view of the lights, but you get the idea. Gradient uno tres, number four. That's right. Red, white, and blue, America. Another example of America. <clears throat> Oof, excuse me. And now the moment you've been waiting for animations. Animations tab, there are actual motion of each effect, as you can sort of see. And again, just select which one you want, hit the send button, whoops, and it sends it to the tree. This one's pretty cool. It's got a little blue bouncing, changing color action. We got kind of a kaleidoscope action where it's rotating clockwise. This one's kind of cool, almost one of my favorites, kind of a rainbow-ish transition from color to color. Very entertaining. Actually, this one's kind of simple but fun. It reminds me of lasers, because you guys know I like lasers. Uh, it kind of has like this sound wave bouncing through the tree. Again, I don't have time to go through them all, but literally there are so many different effects to send to the tree. And what's neat is the company TreeHue is gonna be releasing future app updates which will allow you to even draw on your phone and it'll draw the design that you're creating onto the tree. That's gonna be cool. Now when it comes to setup, it's actually quite easy. It's pretty much just a net that you hang from the top of the tree and then position each strand down your tree where you want. Um, each strand is about six feet long and has 98, no, excuse me, 14 LEDs on each strand with a total of 98 total LEDs. There's also a neat option on the app where you can transition from one to the next at a preset interval. So if you want 
two designs to display alternating every 10 seconds you can or if you want it to go a minute and then switch to a new one you can and blah 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 so if you guys want to know more about Treehue, I recommend you visit their website, www.treehue.com. Uh, they're currently taking pre-orders for the product as it just launched with delivery later this month or early October or something like that. But if you pre-order, you get 20% off, which is like 20 bucks. These run about $99, including shipping. No tax, because it's the beautiful power of the internet. Also, I almost forgot to mention, these fit preferably a six to a seven and a half foot tree. If you have a larger tree than that, you can actually sync up to five sets together through the app and have them work in unison or control them individually. So yeah, if you have like an 18 foot tree or you go out there and you know cut down some massive oak tree for your uh, Christmas tree, you're covered. And be sure to stay tuned for next week's video, which I will be reviewing. These are the Nanoleaf Aurora panels. I just put these up in my house about uh, two weeks ago, and they're stunning. So stay tuned for that. See ya.